Don't you pull anything. And hide that shooter, will you? Freeze! Holster your weapon! Ah, to the head is the best medicine! Valley is in quarantine! Put your weapon away! And come here very slow. Freeze! Holster your weapon and stand still. Try pulling a fast one and you're dead. Stand still. <laughs> is in quarantine. Put your weapon away and come here very slowly. Freeze! Holster your weapon and stand still. Try pulling a fast one and you're dead. Stand still, brother. This won't hurt. All right, stalker. Stay put. Who are you and what are you doing here? He's probably dead already. And I suggest you don't hang around here too long, unless you want to join him. Someone keeps attacking us. They're real professional about it too. We never stand a chance. We control all the roads leading into the Dark Valley, but that don't seem to stop the attacks one bit. The one place you can relax is the base. If you have questions about Fang, the Freedom Base is your best bet. So, what did you want to tell me? Delta, this is Alpha. What was that shooting all about? What's going on over there? Damn, another attack! Mark, check for survivors at the outpost. What's your business here? Everything seems quiet. Dark Valley is in quarantine. Put your weapon away and come here very slowly. No sudden movements. I just... Freeze! Holster your weapon and stand still. Try pulling a fast one and you're dead. Stand still, brother. This won't hurt. All right, stalker. Stay put. Who are you and what are you doing here?
He's probably dead already, and I suggest you don't hang around here too long, unless you want to join him. Someone keeps... So, what did you want to tell me? Delta, this is Alpha. What was that shooting all about? Don't you pull anything. And hide that shooter, will you? Damn, another attack! Mark, check for survivors at the outpost. I ain't too good of hearing. Speak louder. You know that? 
You're just sitting there doing nothing all day. Hey, you go suck my cut. The bullshit, you bozos. You're making the whole place sound like a used car dealership. Too many bombs around here.
the respect of fellow stalkers, do you want to build a team of loyal friends who will stick up for you in times of trouble? Do you dream of kicking some duty ass? All this and many other opportunities await you if you join freedom. Who is it? How's it shaping up, Merc? And quit bothering me over nothing! I'm busy! Alrighty! Hey, buddy! What will you be needing today? Schmerkentalism! Next week, we're expecting some real high-class herb that'll get you higher than high.
comrades. If you're looking to be appreciated and treated like family, that's freedom all the way. There's no chores, no brainwashing, and no morning wake-up drills. If you're a real stalker who loves the free life and a good drink in the company of like-minded fellas, join the right in. We've always got old booze or no blood.
Welcome to my humble abode. Well, well, finally we meet face to face. My name is Chekhov, and I'm the boss around here. The recording on the PDA you found clears things up a bit. All the exits from the valley were sealed off, but our outposts and patrols just kept getting hit. A few times we had a patrol leave the base and get slaughtered in no time. The boys started thinking that we offended the zone somehow, and that this was some sort of punishment. We even tried putting together protection charms against ghosts and all, but as we now know, there was nothing mystical about it. The Commandant gave away all our movements. Freaking rat. I didn't expect him to do this. I've known him for ages. We hunted for our first artifacts together. We made freedom what it is today. I trusted him with all the operational planning, and he just went and sold us out. As soon as the outpost conversation was aired on our radio frequency, the Commandant vanished. He knew he was screwed. What we've got to do now is find him. He knows too much, if not everything. All the exits from the valley are secured, so he couldn't have gone too far. We're tracking his PDA. He's near the road to the cordon. A few of our squads are on their way over there. Yep, there was a stalker like that. We are interested in rare parts and the like. He must have known that we had the best team in the whole zone. I sold him the part he wanted, and why not? He paid well and didn't even haggle. What I don't know is what he wanted with it. These parts were only used in old army cryptographic machines. He left the base straight away, and nobody's seen him since. Yeah, I'll help you. If you help me, that is. Don't take it personally, but we're having a rough time, and if things don't change, Freedom won't have enough men to defend the base from bandit attacks. Help me find out who is attacking us, and I'll give you information about Fang. Find the Commandant and bring him to me, alive. Or dead. Do that, and I'll tell you where you can find Fang. I've uploaded the coordinates of the Commandant's PDA to yours. You got nothing to do with impress even a little girl. Uh, no, you come over. I've got something to show you. Or should I stick it out for you to see? I don't have a microscope. Have you both lost your freaking minds? What is this, a dick measuring contest? Shut the hell up now! and rookies. If you value your freedom, I want to be among others like you. Good luck. Come back anytime. Freedom welcomes everyone who has trodden the zone's paths to our doors. <sighs> Thank you. 
ran into mercenaries by the old farm. We're meeting strong resistance. We need help. I repeat, we need reinforcements immediately.
Come in, come in, Stalker. Thanks for your help. After the shootout at the farmhouse, we know that mercenaries are behind the attacks on freedom. Information from the Commandant's PDA also confirms this. The question is, why the hell are they doing it? Mercenaries have always stayed neutral and cooperated with all of the Zone's factions. I wonder who the client was for this little job. Perhaps it was Duty, or the Army. I've got more questions than answers right now, but I'll get to the bottom of this. You can bet on it. You've held up your end of the deal, and now I'll tell you about Fang. He was looking for rare components here, and I got real curious as to what he wanted with all that ancient crap. When I asked him directly, he told me to mind my own business. <laughs> it's too bad I'm not a quitting type. I asked one of our tech guys to hack into his PDS frequency, and we were able to monitor him for a few days. It looks like he went to the garbage. I'd look for him there. By the way, I made a note of his PDA frequency, and I've already uploaded it for you. His location is now marked on your PDA. Are you ready to help Freedom once again? We know a lot more, but the mercenaries keep attacking us, and we're down to our bare bones here. I still don't know how they're getting into the valley. We've got all the roads covered with our outposts. It looks like there's a tunnel here somewhere that we don't know about. That's how the mercenaries are getting into the Dark Valley. We need to find out where that hole is and blow it to bits. There's an old triangulator in the valley. It was built by geodesists back in Soviet times. The triangulator comprises three antennas. Once all three antennas are activated, you can monitor the surface of the whole valley. If it works, we'll be able to work out how the mercenaries are getting into the valley. One of those antennas is here in the base, but the other two were captured by mercenaries. Help us regain control over those antennas. What the hell? What's going on there? This ain't funny no more. I ain't kidding. All right. Enough talking. Let's get to work. Guys! What's happening? Squad! Come in! Shit! Become a Freedom member! Together, we will save the Zone! The only group of truly free people on Earth! 